Locksmiths are masters at turning simple pieces of metal into functional tools and unique works of art. One type of metal that many blacksmiths experiment with is rebar. While controversial in the blacksmithing world due to this lower quality steel content, the end results of forged rebar can take on a very industrial modern look. If you are interested in using rebar in your next blacksmithing project, Keep in mind that your options for projects are more limited because rebar is known to snap during the forging process when making certain items. Simple tools and decorative pieces are the best projects to stick to when working with rebar. Hello hello dear viewers, welcome back to our channel. Today we have brought to you simple tools you can make from rebar. This video contains a collection of beautiful and practical tools which you can make by forging, welding and or shaping rebar. So we advise you to watch the video until the end to never miss a thing and choose an inspiring project for your metal snake tower work adventure. If you are new to the channel and if you like what you see, please consider subscribing to our channel and smash the notification bell so that you'll be the first one to be notified when we upload new videos. If you are already a subscribed member, Please like and share this video so that it could reach a wide range of audience. Rebar, a short for reinforcement bar, is a steel bar or mesh of steel wires used as a tension device in reinforced concrete and reinforced masonry structures to strengthen and aid the concrete under tension. Concrete is strong under compression, but has weak tensile strengths. Rebar significantly increases the tensile strength of structure. Rebar's surface is often deformed with ribs, lugs or indentations to promote a better bond with the concrete and reduce the risk of slippage. The most common type of rebar is carbon steel, typically consisting of hot rolled round bars with deformation patterns. Other readily available types include stainless steel and composites bars made of glass fiber, carbon fiber or basalt fiber. The steel reinforcing bars may also be coated in an epoxy resin designed to resist the effects of corrosion mostly in salt water environments, but also land-based constructions. Rebar is often found easily as a scrap material from construction sites. Such rebar could be used in making tools of different shapes and sizes and purposes. The basic tools required for the making items from rebar include an anvil or other heavy metal work surface, a forge or heat source of some kind, hammers and tongs. A press is also recommended to flatten out metal evenly and efficiently. A grinder is nice to have on hand if you want to give your projects a more finished smooth look. A few cutting tools that are useful for some of the projects are band saw, a cutoff and a cutoff wheel. Depending on your desired outcome for these projects, more or less tools may be required. Most of these projects can be completed with the most basic tools, so feel free to experiment with the equipment you already have on hand. There are several tools you can make from rebar. These include knives, dagger, forks, chisel, tongs, hacksaws, hammer, axe, lamps, bottle openers, and so on. 
And if you look at the pictures, let's talk about how you can make three of the most common and easy items you can make from Weaver. Number 1. Rebar Dagger or Knife A dagger or knife can, be ma can make a great gift or, I or item to sell at local art fairs. To make a dagger from a rebar of any size, begin by heating and flattening out one end with a heavy hammer. Create a tapper at the end to create a pointed blade shape. Once the blade end of the dagger is formed into the desired shape, Hit the other end of the rebar and create a small tapper. Hammer the tapper in on itself at a 45 degree angle and continuously rotate the bar to create a decorative end for the dodger. You can place a large nut on the end of the rebar and work the metal back towards the nut to create the end. This is optional but is an easy trick for making a decorative handle. The last step in making the dagger is to grind the blade down to polish and sharpen it. Number 2. Rebar Fork A fork is a functional and easy project for blacksmiths new to work with rebar. To, get, to begin, hit one end of the rebar and flatten it out using a hammer. Cut the rebar and make the four times using a cut-off wheel. Once the tines are cut, use a grinder to smooth out the edges of the fork and its tines. Polish the fork down to the desired look and coat it with beeswax for a protective finish. Number 3. Rebar Chisel Another easy and functional tool that you can make from rebar is a chisel. Begin by heating the rebar and forging the point of the chisel. Grind down the unworked end of the rebar and the chisel in to smooth and sharpen it. Reheat the rebar to get rid of any brittle parts of the metal so it will withstand regular use. Rebar handles are also easily made using rebar. Except for decorative purposes, rebar can be used for functional items such as handles. Why would you spend money on various handles when you can make it yourself? Remember, you are a blacksmith. You make things from metal, so keep that in mind. Custom-made furniture handles are quite popular these days, so make sure to include them on your list. Most people are willing to spend more money on custom-made items, including handles. You can either forge them yourself or try for yourself or try selling them. In both cases, you will get something, either a nice handle or more money. We have a video which contains a collection of handles made from Reba. Make sure to watch that video. We will put the link in the video description. Bottle openers. The bottle of the opener, opener is often taken for, for granted until you find yourself in a position when you don't have one. Yes, we all know that they are cheap, but as always, handmade items are simply more appreciable. A bottle opener is a nice small item that can serve as a nice gift for someone. It is one of the easiest projects you can make from rebar. If you are a beginner who wants to sell his work, Consider selling bottle openers. They are one of the most popular items selling online, so it would be a good idea to start with them. Forging them doesn't require any special equipment.
further reviews, as you can see in the video, we have compiled a number of interesting, useful tool ideas you can make from Rebar. Which one is your favorite and why? Let us know in the comment section. By now you know that our channel is full of inspiring videos which you can use in your projects from time to time. If you like our content, please consider subscribing to our channel if you haven't already and also smash the notification bell so that you will be the first one to be notified when upcoming videos. Our YouTube analytics shows that more than 90% of our viewers are now subscribed to our channel. Your subscription means a lot to us and encourages us to create more content. Therefore, please make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you for watching until the end. We look forward to seeing you in our next video. Until then, stay safe and stay blessed.